save her. My daughter. How's it going guys? Lucian Sword here, playing some more Breath of the Wild for you guys today as always. Hope you're having a fantastic day, wherever you guys might be. Today we are going to continue our journey, and it looks like there should be a shrine somewhere nearby. We are just leaving the Yiga hide hideout place. Uh, let's see, I'm, I'm going to put on my snow shoes. I really do want to get the snow boots, but we don't have the snow boots quest yet. Oh look, there's a chest just chilling right here in the open. Five arrows. Oh, hi. Silly ice lizards, I know your weakness is fire. Alright, so there might be a quest like up here. Let's check. Rivali! Fly! Wait, where does stuff go? His monster parts just disappeared? Oh, dang. All right, Wolf Link, lead me to the shrine. Or not, all right, I'll just lead myself. Ooh, another chest. Oh, silver lizard boy. Wolf Link, don't do it. Oh God, he's doing it. That's the shrine up there probably. Get rid of that guy first. Okay, I almost died from one hit. Uh, better equip some more defense. And let's heal real quick. We are not stepping down from these guys. We're going to fight to the end. And we may die doing it. Where the where the golden boy? Oh, okay, he's here. Ow, that hurt. That hurt. We need to focus on one at a time. Do I have any ice? Yeah. You just freeze. And you. Dang it! I was trying to freeze. Holy cow, this is so hard to aim. Alright. Using all my food, but that's okay because. Let's switch to ice arrows. You just chill. Stop jumping away. Oh my. Okay, he's immune to the to the frost. He won't get frozen. Can 
you're not gonna play nice, then I'll hit you off the cliff. Wow, he literally just hit me off the cliff. And I lived! <laughs> we just took a little tumble. Oh, hey. Just die. Oh, he died right away from the fire. All right, cool. All right, we killed some of them. Let's go back up. We're not done with these guys. Wait, is this the wrong side? Where are you guys? I'm not done with you. I want that golden lizard. Wait, they respawn? Ow. Come on, Wolf Lake, I need you. This weapon's probably not the best. My royal bow broke. Got him. These enemy camps take forever to clear out, but I feel like they're worth it because we get so many gems. Drop the weapon. Alright, I think the only one we have left is the golden boy. Hey big boy. You must have an awfully nice bow. Let's hit you right into the fire. Oh, it's a 44 damage steel is all bow. Not terrible, not great. Um, not really sure it was worth it to kill that camp, but probably it was just because we got so many gems. Unfortunately, this camp didn't have like a chest. They do have a lot of bundles of wood though, which are good because we're gonna need it to melt this giant ice block. Oh wow, two of these ice pose up here.
Got one. Please be a blizzard rod. Oh, it's just an ice rod. Alright, so... We'll just start melting that. Look at this, we got a bunch of ore. Luminous stones. Luminous stones. All right, this is gonna take a minute to melt. So while that's melting, I'm just gonna take a sip of my tea. Finally broke it. The Ku Takar Shrine. Frozen in a giant block of ice this entire time. I hope it's a good shrine, not just a blessing. Give me like a really hard puzzle. Melting ice hazard. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This one's fun. Offer before me a block of ice. Only then will the path forward open. As you command, oh mysterious voice, I shall do it. Let's dress for the occasion, you know what I mean? Okay, I got the block of ice. Wow, it's melting really fast. Oh, is it because of my flame blade? <laughs> Let's switch to a frost blade. Alright. That'll help keep it frozen, right? I'm also looking for the chest. So far, I don't see the chest. Oh, come on. I couldn't ju hop step that little... <sighs> Look at that. It's like barely anything. Come on, Link. You'd think you'd be smart enough to not just fall into lava. Attempt number two. I gotta throw it over this too? Easy. Oh, okay, now I actually need the uh... Hey, big hot brick. You're not a brick. Alright, we should find the chest. It's gotta be somewhere around here. Yeah. 
No! My goodness, you can jump over it. Oh, I did not see that. Hey, wait. What's this? Shortcut. Cool, cool, cool. Found the chest. Nice! That's a really, really, really good weapon. This one's about to break. Take this back. This one's actually kind of hard. I'm not sure if this is the way you're supposed to do it, but... Yeah, it's like almost impossible to do that. I can't use any of my other powers. Is there nothing else I can uh, grab in here? Dang. Alright, what if I like walk with the ice like this? Push it. Can I push it? Oh, I can't. I can't really be pushing the ice block. Okay, I figured it out, guys. I figured it out. There we go. You gotta use stasis on the ice cube. Oh my goodness. That was a good puzzle. That was a good one. See, I like puzzles like that that make you think. And we got the chest. <laughs> cool. How many spirit orbs do I have? Seven? Yep. One more and I can get... Wait a minute. How many more uh, stamina, stamina vessels do I need to complete it? Two or three? I think I only need two more, which means... I only need one more shrine to complete our stamina wheel completely. Which would be pretty awesome. So, let's see. Oh, now I'm in the cold again. Alright, now that we have this shrine, I'm actually going to go back to Gerudo Town. We need to get the quest for the, the snow boots. And we need to turn in this quest with the Thunder Helm. And then we'll be ready to enter Van Aboris. Too bad I don't have one more spirit orb or I could I could do the stamina wheel. Alright, let's equip our girl clothes because we're going into Gerudo Town. They still don't trust men even though I'm on like an official quest. I can use the sand boots at least. 
All right, this is the guy who has the snow, snow boots over here. Remember I had to take a picture of the eighth heroine? Oh, he's sleeping right now. We gotta wait till he wakes up. We'll come check on him in a few minutes. Let's go turn in this Thunderhelm quest. Yeah, I need three more stamina vessels to complete the wheel, but... That's oh, alright. Where's the, uh, the statue here anyways? The prayer statue. I literally don't remember at all. Oh, a sledgehammer. I actually love sledgehammers. I don't really need this spear. I'd rather have the sledgehammer for breaking stuff. It just comes in handy. Alright, I know the little prayer statue is like down one of these hallways somewhere. I just don't remember exactly where. Oh, there it is. Let's get stamina. Stamina hype! We need one more spirit orb to get another stamina vessel, but... Okay, we only need two more sections now. So we need five more spirit orbs to complete our stamina. Awesome. All right, now let's go turn in this Thunderhelm quest. There's another quest with the uh, person making garbage in the aqueducts, but I just don't know where that quest starts. We'll find it. Let's go in here with my savage Lionel Spear just to show her what I've been through. Oh, she's she not here? She's probably upstairs. She in her room. There she is. You just chilling up here? <laughs> I've been waiting for you. Oh, you didn't say a word. As a chief of the Gerudo, I can sense the power of the heirloom flowing from you. I know that you've succeeded. I am, as you have no doubt noticed, still but a child. Hmm. The people look on me with nothing but warmth in their eyes. But even this brings me some pain, I must admit. I've tried so hard to be worthy of their love, to be a worthy chief, and to prove to myself that I was worthy too. When my family heirloom was stolen, I felt as though a shadow had fallen over me. Yes, your arrival in the midst of all this must be the work of Lady Urbosa. Now, please give me the helm. Actually, it was more the work of Princess Zelda, to be honest. Uh, yeah, about the helm, I dropped it and it kind of bent. Um, how do I look? <laughs> He's like, you look crazy. Oh. Just chilling on Naboris. Ah. Well, you certainly got here fast. I should have expected as much from the princess's own appointed knight. She was out on a survey all day today. Still as the sands now. So, spill it, boy. Have the two of you been getting along all right? <laughs> it's okay, I know. Your silence speaks volumes. Does it? She gets frustrated every time she looks up and sees you carrying that sword on your back. It makes her feel like a failure when it comes to her own destiny. Don't worry, it's not like you carry blame in any of this. It's unfortunate. She's put in more than enough time. Ever since she was a young girl, she's gone through rigorous daily routines to show her dedication. 
She once passed out in the freezing waters trying to access this ceiling power. And she has nothing to show for it. That's the motivation driving her research. I'd be doing the same thing. She really is quite special. You be sure to protect her with your life. It's quite the honor. The night brings a chill. It's probably time we take her in. Hmm. Or... Babusa! What was that? Did you feel that? Wait, what? How did you... What are you doing here? <laughs> What's so funny? Okay, what does the Thunder Helm have anything to do with this memory? <laughs> Link didn't even look at the helm. <gasps> What's wrong? You're just staring. Anyway, what matters now is... How is it? How do I look? It looks good. I see. The threat divine beast Vandaboris poses has only grown since we began searching for the heirloom. I believe that Gerudo Town itself may be in danger before too long. As chief and as a Gerudo, I must find some way to stop that thing before it threatens my people. Will you help me? Of course. <laughs> Who would have thought that just before such a momentous battle, hearing a simple, confident pledge of support from you would be what puts me at ease? I'll head out now. Let's meet up at the lookout post south of town. There's only one way to get up close to Naboris, and that's with the help of a sand seal. The lookout post isn't too far from town, but you should take a sand seal there. You can get some practice in that way. I'll be there waiting for you with my favorite sand seal, Patricia. <laughs> her, her helmet keeps falling down, it's funny. Still, it really is a little big. Well, what do you think? It's made for adults and you're a child, so. Alright, so that's all we had to do. And we are literally ready to engage in battle for Vonaboris. I cannot wait. It's so hype. Oh, man. Uh, before we end this episode, though, I do want to kind of look around a little bit in the town and just see if we can find the... Uh, the person that starts this quest with the uh, pollution in the aqueducts, I know there's a quest for this. And uh, there's also, we gotta pick up the quest for the snow boots. So let's just look around. And enjoy the music while we're here. Savota! What's a Vi from out of town doing in a place like this? What are you doing? I'm still keeping it a secret from Mama, but I'm growing a fruit garden here. Then I can eat all the fruit I want until my tummy gets filled right up. I haven't figured out what I want to plant here yet, though. If I grow a lot, I'll share some of it with you, okay? Aw, oh, thank you. Here, to start your fruit garden. A banana. Enjoy. Oh, look it. I found a person. Huh? What is it, ma'am? As you can see, I'm busy gathering information. Ma'am, don't tell me you don't know who I am. No way. You've never heard of Rumor Mail, either? I've heard of it. Phew, thank goodness. If you told me you never heard of the Hyrule's most popular news publication, Rumor Mill, well, I don't even know how I'd have taken that news. It would have hurt, that's for sure. I'm Tracy herself, you know. Hey now, get that wishy-washy garbage out of here once more with conviction. Ah. Truth is, I'm Tracy herself from Rumor Mill. I suppose that works. Anyways, I hope you enjoy reading Rumor Mill. I take pride in my work. Oh. Wow. <laughs> that looks pretty cool. I kind of want to go up on top of those posts. But we have business to attend. Let's find this quest. I know for a fact this guy has a quest. Uh, 
You, you came back. I mean, yeah. Hey, of course you came back. What's up? Mm. And look at you, wearing those sand boots already, like a saucy little pink heron or something. You know, gotta say, they're designed for burly men like myself, so I was worried they wouldn't fit such a flower as you. But they look absolutely fantastic. Gosh, anyway, I realized we never really got a chance to chat earlier. I want the snow boots. Mm -hmm. What? You want my snow boots too? Ha, well, aren't we greedy? Or should I say, insatiable for boots. A boot thirst that cannot be slaked. Aww. Adorable. But listen, if I give you these, then I'll have nothing for my feet. Mm. And... Oh man, what should I do? Think, Bozai. Can't put her in a bad mood. Okay, do not blow this. Just relax and work a little verbal magic. Mm. How could I resist a request from you? No lie, you really gave me a surprise earlier, and I love surprises. Surprise me again like that, and I'll give you these snow boots as a surprise oh. present. So let me ask you this. Did you notice that statue of the 8th heroine isn't actually holding a sword? Pretty weird, right? Seven other heroines, they all have their swords. Suspicious, you know. Which leads me to deduce that the 8th heroine must have had a sword as well. Must have. Uh. To see that such a sword actually exists. That my deduction is right. That could be no greater surprise. Oh. Bro, we've already seen the sword twice. We know exactly where it is. Oh. We're gonna go take a picture mm -hmm. of the sword and then we will get the snow boots. There's also a place right here that I want to visit and right here that I want to visit before we leave the desert. Those two places for sure. The Rook's protection is now ready to roll. And I swear there's a quest in Gerudo Town with the with the aqueducts. We'll have to figure it out later. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching. This is Lucian Sword. Hope you enjoyed this video. And as always, drop a like. Be sure to subscribe for the next one. And I hope to see you there. Take it easy, guys.